Citizens of YouTube, restorative capitalism reporting to you from the heart of the Seattle anarchist jurisdiction at Green Lake, Washington, where I am on my way to the north of the lake, right up there, and there is a support, the Seattle Police Department, SPD, and all law enforcement rally. In this video, we're gonna cover what's it like to support the police in an anarchist jurisdiction. Follow along because I believe there will be some counter protesters there, there is a group that calls themselves the ENDD that is planning to be there as well. We're gonna to try to talk to some people. They're supporting the rally. We'll try to talk to some ENDD people. Don't forget to hit subscribe and hit like if you like this kind of content because that helps the YouTube algorithm and it helps this channel. Let's go check this rally out and see what we find. Enforcement. And without them, we are not able to have peace. So get your flags up, your signs up, and hoop and howl if you want to. Otherwise, just wave them and let's have a great time. Thank you again for being here. Talked to a couple of people at the rally that didn't want to go on camera that said that there was a group of about 100, 50 to 100 Antifa that were gathering about a mile away and I decided I might walk over that way and see what I see. I'm across the street from the wading pool and if you look down there you can see there's a small group gathering. <clears throat> They've just started saying some things on the bullhorn so presumably their intention is to start rallying soon. The ENDD march is cruising along Green Lake here headed directly towards the pro support SPD rally. I anticipate about 10 minutes before they arrive. I'm walking along next to them up by the road while they are walking down by the lake. You guys are more than welcome if you want to walk around, march together, but please, just again for safety situations and everything, try and stay in groups of at least two um, because um, unfortunately there are um, possible counter protests. I'm here at the pro SPD rally, ran down here. Got about three minutes ETA before the counter protesters arrive at this location. I can see them a couple hundred yards out. to support the police in the middle of an anarchist jurisdiction. <laughs> and in my experience, those who shout the loudest need the most love. So we're sort of the front line of the NDD I am here supporting the SPD. Hey, baby, hey. And this is a 
group of people that disagree with me. Right. Yeah. 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 I'd love to have a dialogue you with them. They don't want to be on camera, that's why they have these, they, when they're committing crimes and destroying our businesses, they don't want anybody to see their faces. If you have to cover your face, are you proud of what you're doing? That's what I want to know. What you're seeing here is a, a contrast. Anybody That's anybody what they're looking the for. They're looking for somebody to start a fight with them. You don't have the police protecting your First Amendment rights? Well, this is what happens. I know there's some police in the vicinity. I wish they were right here, right now, to block us off from, from that interference over there and maybe to help this gentleman get the help that he needs. But they're not, unfortunately. So we need to do better next time. So, as I was saying, we have a choice before us now. We have a choice about what kind of society that we want to live in. Do you want to live in a society run by folks like this? Do you think that they would respect their, they would respect your rights if they came to power? You would have no rights. If you were to ask how many people do you support the Constitution, they would say no. They would say, fuck your constitution. And you can imagine what your life would be like if they were running a show. Well, the thing is, it starts to look like they are running the show. And that's the problem. There's a very small number of them. In fact, in the entire city of Seattle, 700,000 people, this is probably all they've got on their side. This is all the people on their side. Maybe 200 people, 300 people, and yet they are steering the course of the city. Now that is very, very wrong. If you think it's bad now, what's it going to be like when there's not a single cop here? You think you're going to be safer? You think you're going to be better off? I don't think so. These people are, are running the city. They're running the city council. So what you need to do is talk to your city council member and ask them to denounce this. Ask them to support freedom of speech. Ask them to renounce political violence. Back the blue, back the blue, back the blue, back the blue. I'm talking to Andrew here, who is supporting Culp for governor, and I want to ask him a couple questions. So, Andrew, hi. What is it about Culp? Why were you Why are you going to vote for Culp? Um, common sense, uh, law and order, constitutional. Uh, he has. He's. He believes fundamentally in government as servant to the people rather than the other way around. Certainly through the COVID crisis, we've seen uh, Inslee insist that we be servant to the government, and Culp knows that it's that's exactly 180 degrees backwards. Um, so it's about the government serving the people. Uh, I have a shirt that says insubordinates, not on me now, but it's a, a picture of Culp that says insubordinates across the top because Jay Inslee said that Trump was encouraging Washington uh, encouraging Washingtonians to be insubordinate to his orders. And Culp said, wait a minute, we were never your subordinates to begin with. You work for us. Jay has had it backwards. Socialists have it backwards. They put government at the top of the pyramid. The, liber the liberty-minded person, which Culp and several other politicians across the country believe in, that the government just must be limited and the people need to be liberated. So, uh, the, but the, the polar opposite view is that the government is somehow the god. AOC, all those people believe in Bernie Sanders. They all believe the government is the god, and they bow down and worship the government. We do not. We believe that the government is inherently corrupt, and it must be limited. That's what our founders believe. Pope is one of those. So all, that's just the philosophy, but there's several applications of that in terms of policy that are exactly what our founders intended. Okay, cool. I would love to share how I feel about the Seattle Police Department. But excuse me, excuse me, can I get everybody's attention, please? 
I was wondering if we can have an open dialogue. No! I would love to hear how y'all feel and how I feel. So that was interesting. There was an individual that said, hey, let's have an open dialogue. And then a bunch of people off in the background were like, no, you can't do that. So we'll see what happens. Will we get an open dialogue? I don't know. This all day. No one gets your home, you know? Hey, this dude is a part of the problem. I feel the pit. Don't fucking touch him. I promise you, bro. I'm gonna be that one. You touch him, and I'm gonna be that one. Take your fucking pepper spray. But if you touch him, I'm going to fucking touch him. Watch out! 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 Watch out
make it feel that way. I think the key here is just to know that it really is a relatively small group, maybe a hundred, a couple hundred people that are out there disrupting. And that's why it's more important than ever to speak up because that group is small. That group is a couple hundred people. And they need to hear that most people actually want the police to show up when they call 911. Most people don't want to be the police for their neighborhood. If there's a call to action today, that call to action is to support your local police department. Give this video a thumbs up, subscribe to the channel. Leave me some comments below. I'd love to know what you think and the kind of content that you're interested in hearing more about from restorative capitalism. Thanks and God bless.